Hello all, this is COVID from Witty Sparks. Today we will show how to disavow toxic links using SEMrush backlink audit tool. Open SEMrush and create a project for a specific domain for which you wanted to disavow toxic links or select the project if already created. Now, go to site audit, and then select the backlink audit from the left menu. Here you can see an overall toxicity score panel, if the toxic score is high, then your site is at high risk. A week back, we had a high toxic score with many backlinks from the sites with high toxic scores, and most of the websites were looking spammy and de-indexed or not even indexed by Google. Now click on the toxic domains number or use the audit tab and filter the results by selecting toxic in the audit type. Now you can see a list of sites sorted by toxicity score and hover to see why this link is toxic. Here SEMrush toxic markers show this link is dangerous because this is a de-indexed domain and has mirror pages, so this is seriously dangerous. To understand more, hover over respective headings to understand what these scores are and how they are defined. Let's check the website first by clicking on this blue external link icon and thoroughly scanning the website. This site seriously looks spammy with many irrelevant images, too many ads with zero content, and more. Let me go back and select this particular row, and then you can directly move this link to disavow, but Google always suggests to reach the owner for manual removal. So I'll move this to the Remove tab, again you can decide whether the whole domain you want to disavow or only the link where your site links were placed. Here I'll select URL and then hit Move to Remove. Let me navigate to the Remove tab and search for this particular link, which I have just moved. Here is the link, in the Send Email column, you can see the Send button. Select that, and you can observe that SEMrush already provided you an email template and helps you find the email if that exists on their site. Since there were no email addresses, let me go back to the site and see if I can get any email id to reach them for link removal. Let me see if I have a contact link. Yeah. I found one, but there is no direct email provided, but the site has provided some help to go with that. I have placed the email as per their directions on the contact page. I'll put it in the to field and before you hit send, check the preview of the email template with actual links for removal information, which is smartly presented by SEMrush. You can make the template changes or hit the send button if you are right. That's it, wait for at least a week for their response. If there is no reply or email gives you mail or daemon, then go ahead and move this domain or URL to disavow. I have to take care of this procedure of the links which I found to be spammy, and let me see if there are any links to which the email was not delivered due to non-existing email or received back a mail or daemon. Here I could find one. Let me select and move the URL to disavow. And then go disavow tab and see if the newly imported link is available. Then go ahead and click export to text, you can read the instructions on how to disavow. Once the file is downloaded, go to the Google Search Console disavow tool and read the instructions carefully before uploading the domains or URLs you want to disavow. Go ahead and upload the file and then you are done. Google will scan and take care of your domain ranking, not sure how long this takes to evaluate, but I'm sure this will be taken care of once submitted. Once done. Come back to SEMrush and disavow tab and look for the done button, click on it, this indicates that you have exported and submitted the links to Google. That's it, wait and see your site's ranking. I hope you found this helpful, if so, subscribe and click on the bell icon to notify you when we upload other useful tips on ways to improve your site ranking and visibility. This voiceover you have heard so far is generated from Amazon Polly, one of the excellent text-to-speech service.